So, uh, what's the outside world like? Olympias. What do you wish to know? Well, stuff like the climate, how the people are, things like that. I don't really know. Huh. Is so she strange? sealed us in? No, I just doesn't even you know. know something. But it sounds like it's been some time since you've seen it. Well, I don't think it's a matter of memory. I simply just don't know. Hmm. Oh, don't worry about it. I was just curious, that's all. All I know is that Spyrex use is rampant on Olympias. Why would the people there rely on Spyrex instead of just using their manalopes? Using Spyrex is easier. No doubt the temptation was just too strong for them. I have a question for you too, actually. What is it? Do you... Uh, uh, how do I put this? You sure everything is okay? You're acting weird today. Do it! Say it! Ship is ready for departure. Please ah! <laughs> no shipping here today. I guess we should head back. Musette? Muse, don't scare Jude like that. <laughs> Mila, may I speak with you in private for a moment? You two can catch up. I'll just wait back at the castle. What did you want to talk about? You must never forget that the safety of the schism depends on your survival. I understand. Wait. Is that it? Yes. I thought it best to remind you on the eve of a dangerous battle. Heed my words, and nothing will go wrong. Anyway, shall we go? Wait. You wish to ask me something? Lately, I often feel like my actions are fraught with contradiction. This has never happened before. Do you know the reason why? Do you mean you feel you're putting people in danger when it's your duty to protect them? <laughs> you're imagining things. Elder sister knows best. Now let us go. I don't know. I feel like she's hiding something. Either that, or I Isn't missed something from Jude's side. How did I always ignore these things? It's clear that Maxwell's mission and my own actions contradict each other. If you eliminate the impossible, whatever remains, however improbable, must the be egg true. principle. How's egg principle? In that case, who am I? Mila, what are you doing? Aren't we heading to the castle? Yes. Is she not the Maxwell? Oh, man. She did command the four spirits. I don't know. Oh, it thickens, man. The plot thickens. She did have the four. She does have all the memories of being with them. Here's everyone else. Sorry to keep you waiting. Hmm? That was quick. You could say that. The gang's all here. Let's go see Gaius. Hold on, everyone. Gaius and the others are taking this fight very seriously. We must make sure we are fully prepared. Yeah, good point. I think we're good. Oh no, we have to level everyone up. It's just Rowan. Yeah, it's just Rowan. Never mind. There is no level everyone up, it's just Rowan. What else can I grab? I can grab this. Boom. TP surge. Alright, that's what they want me to get. I think I'll finish off everything else before I go for it. The ears of a monster. Listen, Mila. About 
about Ivor. Why are you whispering? Because Ivor can hear a pin drop half a mile away. That's true. When he flew in on that wyvern, he was able to hear everything we said. So what is it? I wouldn't worry you two. It's the wyverns that have great hearing, not Ivor. They navigate by channeling wind spirits to bring them every noise within miles. They probably just told Ivor what they heard. Do you really think so? If your handmaid really had such good ears, don't you think you'd be a little less deaf to subtext? Oh! oh. So, what about Ivor? Huh? Oh, I was just going to ask why he's so deaf to subtext when he uh -huh. has such great ears. Ah, a popular topic, apparently. I think we're good. Then we can head to the audience chamber. Flying ships. Giant lumps of metal soaring through the sky. Kind of terrifying, isn't it? Do you think so? I find the idea fascinating. I'm quite excited myself. Riding in a flying ship. It's beyond my wildest dreams. Ugh. Yes. Why are boys so into stuff like this? Because it's cool I as hell. I see the appeal myself. Hey, Muse, do these things ever fall out of the sky? I don't know, but... But what? But I don't really care. If it did, I'd just go away. <laughs> well, that settles that. I'll be holding on to you. Oh, man, the spirits, they just don't care about the humans. Finding the local delicacy. I wonder what people eat in Candelar. They've got to have some sort of local delicacy. Do you think so? It's awfully cold here. All the more reason to eat well. So you think they have something good? Let's go find out, Chipo. Hey, wait up! <laughs> it puts an old man's heart at ease to see them enjoying themselves at a time like this. Where would I go for it? The local delicacy. Let's go to the food vendor if we can. Regardless, I probably failed more quests. Uh-oh. I've seen that look on your face before. It's Master Sonia, isn't it? Before I left, Mom asked me to run an errand for her, but I totally spaced. But that was quite some time ago. I'm sure there's nothing to worry about now. Oh, you're dead. Out of it, Leia. We need to come up with a plan. Remember the guy's dumplings they have here? Let's send her some. That's it! We'll distract her with sugar. We'll make it out of this alive yet! Yes. Hey, Jude, Leia. Do they understand the situation we're in now? It appeared to be a family matter. It's not our place to interfere. Oh, you've become quite familiar with humans, haven't you? I've seen a lot on my journey. Well, I'm proud of the fact that the great Maxwell is a member of my family. That's right. You and I are family, aren't we? I once thought about what it would be like to have a family. And? It was I thought it would suck. Before. Very different from my duties as Maxwell. Of the feelings I've experienced, the one that comes closest is security. <laughs> Why do you laugh? What am I to you then? That's a difficult question. I understand the idea of having a family, but I don't think it's the same as what you're feeling. That's not what I asked. Besides, didn't you just say that you were proud to have me as family? Oh, is that what I said? Unbelievable. I'm beginning to doubt that you truly came here in response to my summons. Yeah. All I can say is that there is nothing more important to me than fulfilling Maxwell's What is your aim? Hey, sorry about that. We kind of got carried away. Don't worry about it. Huh? They seem surprised by that. The most important thing to a spirit is the purpose of its existence, its duty. I believe the same is true for humans. But sometimes for humans, there are things that win out over duty. Over duty? Then again, perhaps it's just another kind of duty. The duty to survive. I see. I didn't really understand any of that. But I'm pleased that you were able to convince yourself. Is that it? Is that it for that event? Mixed emotions. Talk to Gaius in the throne room. 
Devil's Beast. I don't think that one will ever fail. You have to kill the Devil's Beast. I'm pretty sure later on. To be continued. What if I said to help? Or nap I help? Nope, it just says to be continued. So all this, all this stuff says to be continued. I'll never know when to continue it. It's a shame that some of this stuff had to be failed. Mission failed. You failed it. Carla's dead. <laughs> you suck. Wait a second. Why is this at the bottom? I probably can't go anywhere, can I? Nope. Alright, let's just keep going. I can't go anywhere. Relay this to all troops. We believe the enemy base to be an enormous structure. All soldiers should review their indoor combat procedures. Yes, sir. I anticipate difficulty getting the word to everyone. Call in all of the relay team reserves. Yes, sir! I see you're keeping busy. Of course. 99% of a battle is won before it starts. So at this point, the fighting is just a formality. I leave nothing to chance. That's why I haven't accounted for your group at all. All I expect from you is a distraction. Should you die in the process, my plans will not... Oh, yes. How lovely. What? Fair enough. Was that true for Zhao too? Did his death not disrupt your plans? It was not, and it did. Zhao's strength was a trusted resource, not a destabilizing factor like your own. He was a man who not only bested me, but even challenged Gaius one-on-one. -on -one. Oh, were you two friends? Friends? Ah, this must be how a child sees the world. It doesn't matter what we were. What matters now is that our military strength doesn't waver from his loss. You certainly don't make your emotions easy to read. You'd be wise not to waste your energy trying. The time of battle is at hand. Rest while you still can. Poor Zhao. Let's talk to him. Are you ready to depart? Yes! Fail more quests! <laughs> Fail them. What are Rashigal's soldiers doing here? I summoned them here, although fewer came than I had hoped. Ah, looks like Ivor's still here too. That fool. He abandoned his duty to Nia Kara. Huh? Your Highness, perhaps a few words. Once, we turned our swords upon each other and fought for control of Riza Maxia. Today, we come together not as enemies, but as allies. We have already located the enemy's headquarters, a ship known as the Zenithra. Fear not the battle to come, brothers. United, we will not falter. Together, we shall reclaim our world! Yes! Woo! Yeah! Launch the ship. Uh, your, your Highness! We've detected a high energy channeling circle surrounding all of Rize Maxia. Here it comes! Oh, uh, they're gonna fire it again. to absorb the entire world's mana the spirit fuel plan i won't let them hurt our people i will protect reza maxia make us airborne 